Welcome to Slash Bash, where today I am bringing you another Choosing Beggar Reddit video. In our first story, a literal beggar wants all my cash. About two years ago, I had to take public transport across the city to meet up with a classmate. Damn pedagogy training school and their unreasonable amount of group projects. While sitting in the train, I got approached by a middle-aged lady with colorful clothes and a thick accent asking passengers for money. I had been in a financially tough spot a while before, but had found an apprenticeship with OK Payment. Since then, I had made it a principle to give my spare change to whoever asked for it first, whenever I was in public transport. So I smiled at her to signal that I had noticed her and pulled out my wallet. I had about six euro worth of loose change with me. I'd need three euro for a ticket to get back home, so I gave her the other three. Usually, that's the point when I get a smile, a nod, a thank you, or any form of acknowledgement, and then they move on. Instead, she hovered over me, almost shoving her nose into my wallet. I want six, she stated. I looked up at her confused, as that was not an expected reaction. Well, I'm sorry, but I can't give you more. I saw you had six euro. Give me six, please, give it to me, she begged, coming even closer. I started to feel uncomfortable, but didn't want to seem rude, so I forced a nervous smile. Look, I'm sorry, I already gave you all I could spare. I need the rest to get back home. While I tried to explain nicely, I should really stop being polite to such brash people in the city. The last time got me spat at. She kept repeating, please, please give me six euros. I want six euros, give it to me, please. Long story short, it took me stuffing my headphones into my ears, putting my hood up while looking out of the window and two more stops before she gave up. Because she doesn't value money, it would be best to send my artwork to her for free. I'd love drawing my house. I collect art. We pay for postage. Absolutely amazing. Would you be interested to fill my house gallery? Hey, sorry, I am replying only now. I haven't noticed your comment. I'm happy to sell some of my artworks. If you are still interested, please contact me. We pay for postage and package, but I collect them so my house is like a massive gallery. I don't sell them on as I find that rude as it's not my art to do so. Sorry to ask, I just want to be clear. Did that mean that you only pay the amount of shipping? Yes, and I post on my art page to 4,000 people, Instagram, 10,000 and other sources. I don't resell on as that's wrong and not the purpose. It's to showcase it to people, as there is so many art that get left in the jumble pile inside the house. This way, it goes to good use, so eyes can see. Thanks for the kind offer, but I already had 9,000 plus views on this one, and I didn't have to send a $380 worth of artwork for free. I'd like to have it owned by someone who wants it so much, they pay for it. That's the best use for it. I do it for those who value it, not because it looks all right in their gaff while it's painted, then removed. Someone who passes it down by generation, who adores it that much they want to wake to it and sleep after seeing it, more than a possession. You get my drift. Would love to have a look at your work, though. If you value it, you pay for it. That's all. Odd, we have opposite concepts as I don't value money. I hate time is money phrase, lol. Wish you all the best for the future. Well, unfortunately, shops are valuing money, and I'd feel uncomfortable dying of starvation. I know, it's odd. I'm helping a friend's mom with some wedding planning. I love the part where she says a few hours for the wedding, which will be from 2.30 p.m. to 11 p.m. So I just talked to the wedding coordinator that you recommended. She is very, very nice. However, extremely expensive for what I'm needing. She quoted me at first $1,200 for her services, which include basically setting up the entire wedding, booking vendors, planning everything. I told her I already had everything set up. I just need a coordinator to run the day of the event and the one hour before the day, which is the rehearsal and she only reduced it to $900. 
That is still ridiculously expensive for just running a rehearsal for one hour on Saturday and a few hours on Sunday at the wedding. So, if you know of anybody who is a go-getter and who is organized and could do this, please let me know. I paid $800 for a coordinator and it was worth its weight in gold. $900 is going to be the market price, but they literally handle everything possible and put out any fires so that you don't have to. That's over $100 an hour! What did they do for you? Travel required? Check. Experience required? Check. Owning your own, very expensive equipment? Check. Paid only in exposure with the promise of being a permanent hire later? Double check. Seeking videographer, content creator, intern for Indie TV Network. Six minutes ago from Los Angeles. Seeking an ambitious, creative, and unique professional videographer or content creator to assist with bikini and lingerie content for independent TV network and photography media studio in Los Angeles. Starting off as a short internship period, then permanent hire due to performance. Must be creative, fun, know how to edit, open-minded, have positive energy, and have experience with a portfolio. Will require travel, mainly local, future destinations to be decided. Must have reliable transportation and be punctual. Please send your website or Instagram link for portfolio. If you have equipment, please list. Please send a headshot along with experience and contact number. You will be credited in projects. No contact number or proof of work, you will not be considered. No pay. <laughs> Choosing beggar claims paying 20 euro is exploitation. Doesn't work out well for her. Hey, do you do video edits? I do. What kind of an edit do you need? I just need you to stitch some clips together, add some music, and some text as well. Sure thing, I'd be happy to do that for you. What's the approximate length? About 10 minutes. I also need it before 2. Do you think you could do that? As in 2 p.m. or 2 a.m.? 2 p.m. today. So 40 minutes. I'm out on a walk right now, but I can run back home and start work on it within 5 minutes. I might have it done by two if I rush, but keep in mind, it'll cost extra. Okay, nice, thank you. How much is it? 20 euro. Are you kidding me? No. I'm home now. It's only five more than my normal price. 20 for less than an hour's work is actually insane. You're exploiting me right now. I'm charging more because this is extremely short notice. Dude, do you understand how much I need this? I'm legit gonna get fired if I don't get this done. Okay, here's the video. Okay, I'll get started on it if you agree to my price. You're literally holding me ransom right now. You're sick in the head if you think this is funny. It's entirely up to you if you want to pay the 20 euro or not. Okay, I'll pay you the money, just get it done. Just add some upbeat music and add a title of Q3 Report 2021. Okay, here's the video, and here's my PayPal account. Nice one. Although, I don't think I feel like paying. <laughs> Fine by me. Flip you, why did you lock the file? Little witch, duck you. I'm sorry, I thought you didn't feel like paying. Even if you change your mind, your payments will be refunded. No! Flip off! Don't do this! Just unlock the file, please! I don't really feel like it. This is John from Slash Bash. Thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, now's the time to subscribe. I would love for you to drop a like, share it with your friends, and I'll see you in the next one.